Hi everyone, so I thought I would do a little ponytail video today because I put pictures on quite often um, of wigs that I've put up in different styles but I don't really often show you how to do it. Um, I know it's quite straightforward, a ponytail, but there's certain little things that you can do to make it look more realistic with a wig. Um, so I'll give you a little demo today. I have chosen Mirage, the lovely Mirage by Ellen Villa today to do the demo on because I also do it on short wigs quite often. I thought it'd be quite good to do a long one. Um, I've not done anything with her before, so we'll have to see how it goes. Um, also, instead of my wide tooth comb, because it doesn't always get the hair properly when you're trying to do an updo, I also have one of these, I'm sure there's a special name for them. I'm not sure what it is but basically the bristles are just straight there's no bobbly bits on the end and these are good they gently brush through the hair and they don't tear the hair if there's a knot they're, um, they're quite good I don't use it too often but only for when I'm styling up because it really does grab the hair nicely so you can see I've already put a little bobby pin in here I quite often do this I like it when wigs are swept off my face a little bit keeps them out of your eyes because if you've ever had synthetic hair in your eye it is a bitch it really hurts um so yeah i like that and i also think it gives it a bit more body on top so it's quite a nice way to style it when you're doing an updo and i've got my hairband and my brush and that is it so i start by just brushing every, holding it up in a little ponytail just a rough one to start with pull the back down because the back always lifts up with the ponytail and then just gently brush everything round into place now i'm constantly the whole time i do an updo every time i move the hair or brush it some more i pull down at the back and lift the ponytail up at the same time so that the little wig's not going to ride up too much and then once you've got the hair up there already you can kind of just move it to exactly where you want it and then give it another brush i also always pull a couple of bits out by the ears i think it just makes it look a bit more realistic as well um, if you want to you can always trim these bits as well if they're too long um, i've done it before and it went okay and then you've got my hairband and literally pull the back down and just tie it as you normally would with any other ponytail. And hopefully it's gone all right. <laughs> there we go, tighten it up, pull the back down. It's that simple, it's just like doing it on your own hair but you have to remember to pull the back down constantly and pull a few bits out so it looks a bit more real. There we go. 